guys, so I'm here with the Psychic Twins. Hi! Hi, and Nessa! Hi, I'm Nessa! Hi, I'm so glad you guys are here. Oh, so it's an honor to be here. But they're here to help me today. As many of you know, I always have paranormal experiences, and they're also going to predict some stuff for my future, because we're going to have a part two on their channel. Mm -hmm. If you guys want to check it out, in the description I'll have the link. So. Are you ready to get started? Yeah, we're ready yes. to get started. We're ready. Um, so, Nessa, yeah. I really feel like there's a couple of ghosts in here. Yeah. And I think you know that. Or, yeah. <laughs> right. um, yeah. There's a couple. One's a male and one's a female. Uh, you're not related to either of them. They're not oh, ancestors. Really? Okay. Yes. They're just attracted to your light. Most ghosts are not inherently evil or dangerous. And so I think we invest a lot in that just because of all the Hollywood horror films and TV mm -hmm. shows. But the fact is, they're mostly not going to hurt you. Uh, I feel like if you've had any experiences like um, like phantom scratches or bruises or things like that, yeah. okay, then that it, it just usually is an indication that they want your attention. And if you clear it with sage, we brought some sage to burn, and it's really a good clearing. Um, tool to have and you should probably do it once a week or once a month until they're gone but we are going to do some sort of chanting and uh, saging of your place to help you clear the energy. I think they're attracted to your light as well. Yeah, you're very much of a healer. I feel like you're a true crystal yeah. child which means you're, uh, you're younger than the indigos, but you're here to hold a vibration on the planet, and you're very, you're, you're like the teacher and healer of your family. I feel like there was a grandmother who is very psychic as well. One of the most strong energies I felt from YouTubers, to be honest. Mm. And so sometimes I feel like, you know, whatever you're doing, you're having this healing energy on people if that makes any sense. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's very positive, but Fair. sometimes ghosts are drawn to us when, you know, we're shining like a beacon. And I also feel like we have to be careful of the thoughts we think and the language that we're saying, mm -hmm. because if we say, oh, I have bad luck, or I always attract bad energy, we can attract more. It's the law of attraction, right? Yeah. So I want you to just be mindful of what you say, Nessa, and you know, you could you could say, you know, I'm lucky. I attract good energy. I fill my room with positive white light, and you can just imagine, you know, white light just filling your whole apartment. I'm and safe. That would help. I'm safe. I'm, I'm safe. always safe and protected because you really do have very good karma. Even though I think sometimes you you doubt that. You have uh, really a lot of fortune in this life. Are you in touch with your guardian angel or with your angels? I feel like I am. My mom would take photos of me and there would always be like some sort of flash on top. Really? Uh, it was like really weird. A light or an like orb? Was yeah. it in like the shape a streak of an or something? Mm -hmm. Um, I feel like that's that, that that's your guardian angel. is your guardian angel. And she, her name is Catherine, by the way. So you can mm -hmm. talk to her and you can meditate and you know, Bring in that white light and just say, Catherine, help me, and talk to your angels. Archangel Michael is very strong around you, too. Mm -hmm. So I feel like you're always protected. I really do. I feel like you've had some scary experiences, but you had this kind of a wall of angels around you very as a support so. system. Good. Yeah. <laughs> so it's all so good. There was a past life as a Mayan Indian. In, uh, in South America, there were, it's a very strong life, and I think, I noticed you have some tattoos. Mm -hmm. I think that some cool. of them are actually connected. Oh my god, those look like crystals on them. Yeah, it's supposed to be crystals. Those are, oh, those are gorgeous. I think that that's connected to the fact that you were a healer in that tribe, in the Mayan oh, culture. Adding up. Yeah, it's starting <laughs> it's to make all sense. making sense. Yeah. Through the clearing, we're going to burn some sage, and we're going to say a chant called Nam Myoho Renge Kyo. It's which, a Buddhist uh, mantra. It's our Buddhist mantra. And we've been saying this every day for 31 years. Now, and, yeah, Buddhism is really a philosophy of yeah. life. It's not, it is a religion. Mm -hmm. But it's more of a philosophy, and you can be any religion and still chant Nam Myoho Renge Kyo. So uh, let's get started. It's right? like a practice, yeah. <laughs> okay, now we're lighting the sage. Oh, okay. This is a Native American tool oh, that clears oh, energy. Okay. Is the ghost coming? The ghost is. The ghost is. We, so have this, we have this effect on everything. Stop Let me get out. my matches. Yeah, let's get matches. I brought them. Uh, okay, now what we're doing. Okay, I, I think I will carry this. 
um, is, is we're, we're smudging or we're saging the area and it's really a good idea to do it um, like get in every corner, every crevice, even the in-between places in your apartment like closets, mm -hmm. hallways, you know, things like that and you want to keep it moving and waft it. Into the, the corners and closets. Into the corners and, and corridors and we're just for the sake of you know, of the film, we're going to just do uh, a one room, and then you can do the rest of the rooms. But you want to get down into the the floor, you know, everywhere where the ghosts may hide. And they they do hide a lot. And we've had ghosts all our lives, and they make a racket. Let me tell you. I'm just going to do uh, a little bit of Reiki healing as no. well. Chokare, chokare, chokare. Okay, so we're just gonna kind of spread the good vibes around. No. Let's clear your energy, girl. I've been doing it. <laughs> they, they tend to come back sometimes. Just keep smudging, clearing the area with the sage. This is a, a very powerful thing. Many Native Americans have used the sage to cleanse a, a space. Go into the light now. Go into the light. Go into the light. Say it right Go into the light. Bye. Steps or, or you see lights blinking on and off that can sometimes be a positive spirit, but you want to clear it anyway. So just say go into the light and do, you know, the chanting. It really, really clears the energy. I don't know if you take baths, but if you can take a bath and put a little bit of salt or Epsom salt in the bath, it will clear your electromagnetic energy. Very, very healing. Don't put too much in, you know, just a little bit of salt, uh, Epsom salt. Okay, I'll try that. And that'll really help. You know, as a YouTuber, anyone who's a YouTuber, by the way, you know, this is your uh, turquoise blue chakra. Your energy center is right here. This is your place of power. Mm -hmm. So it's like a cone-shaped energy center. And you can just put your hand right there and, you know, just clear it. Just, you know, visualize a gold or white light, or you may want to bring in turquoise light. Send it into your uh, throat chakra, your... A loving communication center and you can clear that energy okay okay thank hey. you for cleansing it oh so you're well. so welcome honestly nice. everyone that watches <laughs> knows like how much scary stuff happens to me so it's like uh, i need this uh, yeah. oh yeah this is good that's why we're here where? we're your psychic fairy godmother you, you pulled us right in you pulled us right in we're glad we could be of help sweetie well, thank you Time so we'll much bring our magic wands <laughs> Yeah, thank you so much. Me. Thank you so much for cleansing it, and like, thank you for pleasure. coming. Oh, it's our pleasure. Thanks for having us here. Thank you, of course. Sweetie. And we're gonna have like a prediction, and I'm gonna ask them a ton of questions on their channel. Mm -hmm. So if you guys want to check that, check that out, you should. And we'll see you in the future. Bye. <laughs>